me and my little uh, homie, Nurse Blue, was all chilling on the beaks. On be beaks? <laughs> on beaks. On the beach. Oh, I apologise. So, Nurse Blue, you've got a task to do now that we're finally done this. I didn't realise we can get this earlier, but we can We could have got this earlier, but we didn't because I thought it was in the other area. But it's not. It's actually down here. This dark crystal. It's the last dark crystal for Evernight Resort. So we just collect it. Right, yeah. So this one I thought was over in the area we've just been to last episode, but it's not. It's actually down here by the beach where the spell catalyst was. So we could have got it then, but I forgot. So that's that done. That is now Everlight Resort completely filled out. We've killed everybody. We've destroyed the town pretty much. And we have collected every little hidden detail within this little island, which is, of course, you know, a bonus. Right. So now we'll leave the village, this, this village, this resort to be inhabited by none other than the... You know, Everlight Guard. And we shall go. So for today's instalment of Overlord 2, we are going to go back to the Overlord Dark Tower and proceed with the more audience member visuals we have. If you know what I mean, what I'm trying to say, I have no idea. We're going to do the Dark Phoenix thing. Dark Phoenix? Oh. Dark Phoenix. Oh, that's, that's X-Men. Don't mean Dark Phoenix. I mean the normal Phoenix that we're going to fight, right? Quick, Jester, anything new? Jewelry Smasher! Maybe? No, Sire did find a sanctuary, a place of magic light. He smashed it up, he smashed it down, and had a real good smite. I think we have had that one, but I was wondering. Gnome Grinder! He's hunted down the little pests. Their pointy hats did run. There's nothing like a gnome on fire to make for evil fun. <laughs> We we'll stay here until we've heard them all. Nightmare! Evil of Everlight! Everlight was an Empire playground, a place of great excess. And now our Lord has conquered it. Their tourist traps the mess! Juno's champion! Oh, Juno is a lovely sight. I'm almost moved to tears. I hope she will sit down with me and gently stroke my ears. Tyrant of Nordberg. Sire is Tyrant of Nordberg, feared by one and all. No one can stand against him, and those who try will fall. Spider Squasher. Sire did kill the Spider Queen. Her reign of terror ends. The queens are very happy, cause we've got her little friends. King Killer! The Salamander King is dead! He's just a piece of meat! The Reds are celebrating, cause his mouse will save their feet! Fairy Flattener! Right, we listened to quite a few there. Well, I did just pause this to watch. Yeah, there's still probably quite a few to listen to, but we'll do that next time. Because uh, we don't want to see that. We'll probably do it at the end of an episode, actually. It'll be like pointing sort of thing. The pointing? What do they used to do at the end of things? Uh, it'll be like, like a mini pointing thing. Anyway, so let's go and see Phoenix at Battle Rock. Now I'll send him in. An outcast from the Wasteland is requesting an audience, Lord. Oh, hope he doesn't mutate all over the place. It's risen up! The Phoenix! Risen from the ashes of the last sanctuary! We saw it burn across the land, scorched through the earth into your domain! You must face it in combat, or it will set fire to the world! Oh, I think setting fire to the world's a very good thing. As long as you don't set fire to my domain. Anyway, except let's go and fight face this monster. Good luck, Master! Now, how about a little reward for this information? Denied! Oh, everyone's a chancer! Now go see to that flaming chicken, Dark One. He's not a warrior chicken. He's just a pumped up little firebird. I feel a little bit like a witcher now, going to fight some sort of monster, like a phoenix. I should, I should prep my Quen spell. My silver sword out. Or is it going to be a steel sword? Because you never know which one is right. You could say that the silver one is just for monsters, but it's not. Sometimes iron works very well efficiently against a monster. Yeah, I am reading the Witcher book, the old last witch. Anyway, Phoenix Flames, round one. Let's get this sorted out and done then. Let's go do this. It's actually a lot later than I thought it was. Not that you care. I'm just surprised how late it is. Oh, I was going to get some minions. 
Oh dear. Right, I don't know this the strategy of this. I think I know. I'm not sure entirely though. So let's go find out, shall we? So ten of each. Luckily we can revive. Twenty of these. I'm pretty sure we do have a spare newbornish creature. And then reds. Somebody tells me they might be invaluable with this since it's gonna be a firebird. But it never seems to work. Anyway, come on in, Moltrace. Let's do this. Oh, that phoenix looks angry. Well, I'd be pretty angry if I had to go around bursting into flames all day. Round one, fighting the phoenix. Oh, Dark Phoenix. You battle some before your minions die, so don't lose all your minions. It's coming down this way. Okay, what's the plan? What's the plan? Oh, it's I wouldn't get too close to that. It's in range. Hmm. What's the plan? Magic. Slows it down, which we know. Let's take off to the skies. Ah, I know. I think I remember. I think I remember. Get on his back. Go greens. 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 Greens, why are you being silly? Why are you so silly? It's coming down. Run. Flee. Flee before your lord. Oi, minions. This is not the time for resting. Blues. Blues, if you can... Revive him. Revive the fallen beasts. Right, greens, come on then. This time you're gonna get it done. What instead? What if instead I do everybody? Everybody go! Good, finally! You finally obeyed your bloody overlord. Why is there only a few going on? Somebody tells me this is bugging out. I'm sure this is what you're supposed to do. Alright, minions. Come to me. Come to me, come to me, come to me. Come on in, Hoppy. Anyway, your skills have been assessed. And it is very delicate. Uh, delicate? You'll be a very valued addition to our evil family. That thing's nasty when it's on fire. My money would be on using the greens. I was using the greens, but the greens didn't do anything. Go on, kill this pumped up bird. It will not become part of my evil empire. It will destroy itself. Wow, that was quite powerful, actually. Minions, quick! Retreat! Retreat! Oh, burning, the burning, the burning, the burning. I'm going in, I'm going in. Nurse Blue, you've got a big disaster on your hands. Medical emergency. Okay, so clearly from what he said, it has to be clip greens, but I thought everyone can do it. And the greens can do it. There we go, now it's working. If we go around the front, there we go, everyone go down, in. Yes, if you do not become part of my evil family, you will be destroyed. Where's coming down, where's coming down? Over there, okay. So far, so good. I'm surprised we haven't lost more minions, to be honest. I'm guessing this is the last time, because obviously we're, we're not going to kill it. We're just going to take him down to about half health. So I'm hoping this is going to be the last time, because my mana is going out. Once I've lost all my mana, I don't know what I'm going to do. But now I know what to do. Right, round the front. There we go. Minions in. Let's finally kill this little birdie. If you've not signed a contract, you will be determinated. It will not be used against me. Oh wow, they actually did that as well there as well. Right, quickly. Whoa, 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 what's happening? What's happening? Something happened there. Huh? Burning, I think. Right, now I think I know what the next stage is as well. I think the next stage is he bursts around the whole arena while on fire. So oh, I don't know how I'm gonna solve that. Probably get out of the way somehow. Maybe hide within those green parts. I know I can. Come on, greens, bring him down. 
Grangey failed. You're lucky I have a little bit of mana left to take him down. Fly away, birdie. Good. Where are you all? Right, greens, come on then. Don't stand with his tail. You catch on fire. Come on, greens. 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 Get up there. Great, he's going to come down. I've got no mana, so I don't know what I'm going to do. Is he dead? Bring him down. Why are you not on his back? Why does this not work? Right, how do we do this? How do we do this? How do we do this? Just run around. Give him the run around. You choose all. Something tells me that might get a bit boring now. Just walk a little bit like a chicken, doesn't he? Let's just take you to Harvest Moon. Have some of that fiery eggs. Yes. Anyway, why will this not... Just imagine having this for the tower. Like, this this could be in your throne, like on a perch. Or you could have a zoo, an Overlord Zoo. That'll be fun. Right, okay, why is this not working? Go in. Face me, bird. That's it. You don't like it when your prey fights back, do you? Right, come on with me, minions. It's now or never. Right, of course it was. I thought it was going to be that way. Right, okay, greens. Come on, get on back. It's not on fire. There we go, perfect. Right, minions. Going. Moving, minions. Defeat this bird once and for all. Have it, cockerel. You've defeated the better beast, so we have killed it. Quick, Gash, go scoop up the remains and drop them in the deepest ice lake. Let's see it resurrect from there. Perfect. But as you can guess, obviously, if you know the, the legend of the Phoenix. Wow, that was amazing. Like the legend of the Phoenix. Beat that keeps on giving, something like that, is it? That song? I can't remember now. Yes, uh, if you know the legend of a phoenix or the mythology of a, of a phoenix. Uh, what is it? I can't think. Mine's gone blank. Yes, when you kill a phoenix, or when a phoenix dies, it just gets reborn from its ashes. That's what it's like, you know. Rebirth, rebirth of a phoenix. They just rebirth from their, their own ashes. So uh, that's why we've got around two, because he's just been reborn again. We weren't quick enough in getting his ashes to an ice pool. Right, who need blue anyway? Right, we need a blue, and that's blue to replace, and we need a green to also replace. Right, okay, let's do this then. I'm assuming it's going to be the same sort of procedure as before, with a little bit of difference. Probably going to be able to talk over this cutscene. Yeah, probably. I would love oh, can you imagine breeding as well? You can have like... No, that's probably that's a bit too far. But breeding, we can have like two phoenixes, you can breed them. No, I think I'm getting ahead of myself. Round two. Phoenix time to kill. Like the legend of the phoenix. Uh, right, I'm going to do the same as what I did last time, because that actually worked very well. Come oh, here, you. Oh, get too close to that. That's right, fly away, birdie. Minions, come to me. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Careful, minions, careful. No, I was right the first time, I was right the first time. Right the first time. Everyone okay? Anybody dead? Anybody dying? Is anybody dead or dying? Please. Right, okay, so I don't know what the third round will be, but this one, I thought this, this is definitely the next one I thought it was going to be, so that's alright then. Right, they're going to kill him. Bring him down, hopefully. Bring the bird off his perch. Oh dear. Oh dear, what? We brought him down. I thought we did quite well. It. Slam him. Regroup, regroup, regroup. He's over there, he's over there. He's gonna do some sort of move. That's it. Weren't expecting me to fight back, were you? <laughs> That's what he's like, isn't he? Right, minions to me. Keep your feet in. Arms. Please, please keep your arms and feet inside the minion circle at all times. Thank you. There we go, he'll do his thing. Yeah, he does. When you smack him, he's like, oh, he didn't expect you to hit me. 
He's not very powerful, is he, really? I mean, he is if you stupid. He is if you do something stupid, like I have done before. But he's not exactly the brightest bird in the flock, is he? You choose all. Right, good. Go, move in. Oh, this is better. This is much better. Yes, we will. Now that we know what to do. Oh, good. Oh no. I was hoping we we're going to get like a one, just one more round. Let's go the other round. Come here, chicken. I'm trying to think of some other th fire birds. That's it. Back. <laughs> oh, look at Captain Comment. He was doing some nice fancy work there, weren't he? Smacking it with his big old giant, you know, centurion sword. Right, okay, so we'll do this thing again. I was hoping this is going to be the last time, but I think we might not be able to get down all the way. If we're quick, we might be able to. Greens. Greens. It's going to land. It's going to come in for landing. Perfect. Right, jump up. Good. Oh. Everybody else join me. He'll jump down. We'll try and quickly kill this blasted bird. Come on, push forward. I don't know if we're going to do it, but it's worth trying. Blues, why are you not doing anything? Quick! No! Oh, so close. Damn it. Right, okay, we'll fight him again. Come on, you. Ow, I'm burning. I'm burning. Everyone is burning. Did it work? It did work, though. Right, everyone in. Please keep your claws and talons inside the minion circle at all times. I don't want to send, you know, we are sorry for your lost messages to your minion families. Assuming you have families. I mean, the question is debatable whether about the, you know, the, you know, all these things about minions. It's debatable about how they all work. We've had this debate in the first game. Was it the first game? Or was it in this game? I can't remember when we had this debate, but we don't know how minions reproduce. I seem to, th I think, the life force. Oh, burning from his dead body. That the life force gets converted into minions. Although, oh, they've had that already. Yeah, or perhaps from what we've seen, maybe it is that. But they can reproduce. Uh, what's the word? Biologically? Yeah, biologically. What's the opposite of magically? They can reproduce with normal means, normal conventional methods. But obviously, the main force of the thing is through magic. Yeah, that makes sense, doesn't it? So maybe that's actually how they reproduce. Anyway, last one. Phoenix Flames, round three. Let's do this, and then we can get on with the main story after this. Right, I would like to restart the video. Good luck, sire. Let's go and battle this bloody phoenix for the last time. Good. Let's go sort it, then we can move on with our lives. Right, so what have we got to do after today? So after we've done this, I think it's pretty much straight into... No, it's not. We'll get a forge stone. So what we'll do is we'll beat, defeat this beat phoenix. We'll uh, collect oh, on its bounty. Angry. You know, we'll take off its head and we'll perhaps use it as a minion champion. Which we do have. I can't remember who has it, this one. Oh, this one's a good one, this one is. <laughs> Perhaps these phoenixes are like the owls where they're nodulable. Anyway, phoenix, round three. Gravity. Right, yeah, because uh, obviously they say that owls have a lot of knowledge. Perhaps in this game, phoenixes have a lot of knowledge, which would make this minion's champion's owner very clever because he chose the right minion. Because this guy that has adopted this minion definitely knows his stuff. About Overlord, and, and often moans at me for not doing things the right way. Oh, I like it when guests bring presents. What? No. No. For me. Well, you learn something new every day. Ah, they're in league with the evil gnome free. Get up there. Oh. Come on, bring him down four times. That's what we need. Why not bring him down? Because no one's up there. Why are you not up there? Minions, you s Oh, I hate you sometimes, seriously. Right, come on in, you. Oh, no! It keeps happening! Where's my fireproof armour? Right, everyone in the middle. Can we get... Can oh, his, his tail definitely does actually make things catch on fire. That is horrible. Right, so he lays eggs. Exploding bombs. Right, we'll spin around just to get them all dead. Maybe we do magic rounds to kill them all. Or well, we would, if we could. 
No, not on them. Up there. Good, they're on him. They're on him. Or her. Him or her. Don't know what it is. But be careful not to lose all my health to these bloody gnomes. Come on, take him down. Damn it. Don't like these gnomes. Use magics. We'll use our magics to take him out. Why is there an explosive thing already? Oh, it was a, it was a gnome on me. I get it now. If I knew it would work, I'd leave my greens on a target marker just there. So that, um... So that when, obviously, the time came, they would just jump on top of him. But I don't think it would work, so I'm not going to even try. But the good news is I do think we have killed them all. Greens, greens get prepared to jump on his back. Good, backstab in action. There's only a few on there. Why are the rest of you not going on there? That'd have to be enough. Damn it, it wasn't enough. I hate it when that happens. It just makes the heart all so much harder. Right, is that enough? You just need to damage him. Oh, you just need to damage him a little bit just to shock him out of the floor. Because obviously, if you think about it, I suppose you would say that the Phoenix, his strengths lie in the air. On the ground, obviously, he's slow, he's cumbersome. So perhaps he realises that once you um, damage him a little bit. Let's kill these little gnomes. Greens. Get the greens. Go on, greens. Oh, he's down, he's down, he's down. Go. Thank you. I know now, I said that myself just moments ago. I wish we'd do a stabbing action. They always seem to work very well. Oh, Seems like it's going to take six times to get him down just to kill him. Come here, you. Control. Sign the contract. Silly birdie. We need an Avery. Come on, do your thing. Do your thing. Phoenix, do your thing. Order of the Phoenix. That's another quote I could have said. Right, he's going to come in this side. Go. Bring him down. Make your master proud. Now he should come down. Good he is. Right, charge. Everybody charge. Everybody charge. On, the, on it. On it. On him. His face. I saw they were smashing his face in. Minions, get away! No, okay, we'll take him down here. I'm on fire. I'm dying. Watch that, watch that. That might be a problem. That might be a problem later. Keep, make sure my health's staying up. Right, I'm, very, I'm very tempted to cut out this boss panel. I mean, we're doing the same thing over and over again, so we might not want to see it, but. You might get angry. Alright, I will. I will cut it out and see if something else happens. Very nearly dead, but this might be the last time. So let's do this then. Right, good night, Phoenix. Sleep tight, please. <gasps> Perfect. Quick, Gash, go scoop up the remains and drop them in the deepest ice lake. Let's see it resurrect from there. Ah. Oh. And to celebrate your win, here is a new forging weapon. Ah, oh, at last. Right, where is everything that I need? So, it looks like there's some stuff down here, but I don't think that's what I want. There it is, right by the front of the arena. Oh, yeah, that was very dangerous. I nearly died. So, damn gnomes. And, and I did catch on fire as well. That sort of brought it down really low. Right, you little chap. You were invaluable with that fight. Join the ranks of the minion champions. And you, sir, are Horrier's minion. Horrier, the Phoenix puncher because you punched that phoenix right in the face give me five little dude he's perfect look at him fantastic right all right then everyone move out what am i doing now probably going to revive some minions and go to the forge and then we shall go and continuing on with the main story in the everlight hills empire hills sorry. very well here we are in the forge going to do some forging. I'm going to create some things. Instead of destroying things, we're going to take a leaf out of my book and create some things. So if we go down here to the old forge, with a new forge stone, which we can't see because they don't exist. Uh, we've got from the phoenix. We should now get the chopper. Have we got enough? We've got 75 greens, reds and blues. Uh, it's all 25 reds. 
and we've got enough money, we've got enough large crystals or fairy crystals, this blade can slice and dice at great speeds with extra damage on directional strikes. Perfect. The chopper. Let's take this. So we do with the phoenix, we can do like a flip the other. The phoenix flames. Phoenix flames, maybe. Phoenix flame. Mm. Not sure. Thinking about a name for it. Because obviously we got it from the Phoenix, so. It's quite cool. It actually looks like a, like a futuristic sword, like if you think about like the Buster Sword from Final Fantasy, or think about um, that transistor game, that sword from that. It does look similar to that. Although I did think thought it was on fire. But it does do the slicey news again. Good, right, next time I'm going to see you at the throne where we have an audience with the whoever. Now we're going to make an evil plan. Right, we're going to sit down now on the throne, the top throne. I'll tell you what, it's really cool in the cutscenes, where you just see these snake heads poking out like, ah, I'm going to eat ya. Anyway, assault plan. Let's finally make an assault plan to take down the Empire. We are the only Empire. If you're ready, sire, we'll take the Tower Heart to the edge of the city. We need to find a way of firing it into the city wall. The release of magical energy will be able to knock out the anti-magic shield for good. Remember, your choice of first mistress will provide mounts for certain minion groups. Mistress Kelda can provide your browns with wolves. Mistress Faye can bring your red salamanders. And Juno, oh Juno, she will make sure your greens are fully mobile. Are you sure you're ready, master? I am Narl. Right, here we go. Battle, we're going to go into the Empire Hardlands, we're going to take down the evil Empire. Hopefully we won't finish it today, but we might finish it today, actually. Or tomorrow. No, not Friday. We're not sure we're going to finish it, but we might finish it very soon. Alright, let's go make a start anyway. Off we go. To the Empire Hardlands. Beam me up, Empire. I mean, evil Empire people. <laughs> Minions. Good. Oh, hopefully we... I don't know. I think we might... There's obviously there's still quite a little bit left. If I look at my old little list, I need to actually change this list. Uh, we've only got one million champion left, so the next episode will probably be called that, or the one after that will be. Um, then we've got only the collectibles left in these two places we're going to now. Close as Grubby could get to the city's anti magic shield. You'll need to bring the Tower Heart closer to be able to do any lasting damage. And that's the best kind of damage. With the help of Giblet, the minions have managed to build three catapults. There are three nearby hills that would make good spots to use them. You'll need to wipe out the Empire forces nearby and bring the Tower Heart onto the hill so I can send Grubby in with the catapults. Ah, I can practically smell the carnage, sire. Yeah, it's finally time for war. Release the minions of war. We obviously have this little thing here. No, not that thing there. Not sure where it is, but we'll obviously get our mounts as well. And that little cutscene where you saw a little giblet, not giblet, uh, Grubby, the, min the minion digger. Digger, dig, hop, what is it, digger master? Digging master? I forget what we called him. Yeah, but he was standing on top of this hill. That little cutscene there is rather annoying because it always plays in the credits. <laughs> but it's still pretty epic. Because there's the Empire. We've got to get to three of the seven ho hills of Rome, perhaps. Take everything down. Oh, well, cool. That little fortress there. That is where our last minion champion will be crowned. Will we get there today? I don't know. Well, well obviously not today. For me today. So, this week. Right, collect all our minions that we need. I hope we have a, a spare minion. Because we do need a spare minion. In fact, when this... When I need to pause to do the next episode, I will count all my minions to make sure I've got everybody and got enough people to actually survive. Right, everyone's there. Here's the tower heart. I think if you use your evil presence spell on it, it you actually get back mana. I'm not sure if Nile said that yet or not. Or if he'll say it later. Right, let's continue down the hill just for a little bit, just to start off prepare ourselves for the next episode. Oh, it's like a light source, that bloody tower heart. My wolves are ready to help you rip out a few empire throats. 
Good luck, dearest. Make Solarius pay for bringing Boreas and his crevices to Norberg. Thank you very much, Mistress Calder. Your uh, what's his name? Moonpaw and his team of wolves would be very helpful. And look at this. This sword looks amazing. I'm going to cut your throat off. I mean, what? 